you in a bit. I want to focus on the Dow. When I talk about the markets, I tend to talk about S&P 500, but just in general, today's importance can't overstate it. So many key levels broken this week, and the Dow, here's the reason to focus on it. You have not seen back-to-back drops of 300 points or more since 2008. Obviously, a horrible year for so many investors. ARC Financial Management Managing Director, Aftershock Investor, author Bob Weinmeyer is with me now. So, Bob, you're saying the Dow is going to fall further, down to 15,000. Why do you say that, and by when do you expect to see that level? It's hard to say exactly when, but why I say that is that I think without money printing, uh, that what's really that's what supported this market for the last five years, uh, that it's vulnerable to decline. But I think the Fed will step in if the market falls 20 percent, which is about 14,700. And again, probably so hold around on, number Bob, like, not to cut you up, yeah. but when you say when, if the Fed were to step in, do you mean if the Fed were to raise rates in September? I mean money printing, meaning QE, QE4, buying, you know, $80 billion a month worth of bonds. So real live, heavy QE. I'm not as worried or focused on rates as everybody else is. I'm much more focused on that money printing because we found that's what really helps boost the stock market. So I think until we see that money printing, I'd be a little nervous, well, more than a little nervous about this market going down another upwards of 10%. Okay, and as far as drivers, I hear you say that until the Fed steps in, that this is de facto in your view what's going to happen. To take the flip side, Bob, what about people who say there are pockets, serious pockets of strength in U.S. corporations? That is to say, tons of cash on the balance sheets. You do have pretty efficient runnings, as many companies Mm -hmm. have almost been criticized these days for showing themselves to run in that way. What is your take on at least those two elements? Yeah, I mean, there are clearly always going to be in any market some winners, uh, even if the market goes down. But to me, a, a very good indication of where corporate America stands, the S&P 500 is looking so far to, at a year where the revenues have hardly gone up, uh, in fact, have gone down. And revenues, I think, are a really good indication of what the true health of your economy and the true health of your, your stock market is. They're not going up. That's not a good sign. Bob Wiedemeyer, thank you so much for joining us, author of Actor, Aftershock, rather, Investor.